Hey guys, today we're going to make uh, two four by eight foot beds. We're going to start off, uh, went to the big box store and I bought three two by 12 by 16 foot boards. And I got the untreated ones. And there's my little helper thunder there. I got the untreated ones. And what we did is we had them cut two of the 16 foot boards into half. So that made that gave me four eight foot pieces and one of the 16 foot boards into four four foot pieces so that gave me my uh four end pieces and i bought some uh what do we got there three inch neck screws i think we got what do we have there yep three inch deck screws and we got a impact drill and a regular drill. And they seem to be doing a pretty good job. Those are my little uh, Ryobis. Not that expensive, but doing a pretty good job. We got one bed almost as simple here. We got one more corner to do. And what I do is I, I found a, some scrap uh, four by four pieces. And what I like to do is I cut them into uh, 10 inch blocks and I use them to reinforce my corners. And the reason I do 10 inch blocks is uh, if I cut them 11 and a half inches, then this would come all the way up to the top. And when I fill my beds with uh, soil, I like to have that covered up. So that's the only reason I do it. If you wanted to make yours like uh, the same length as the board, then that would be fine. But I like having that covered up when I'm done. Uh, the uh, corner reinforced pieces are pressure treated. The other boards aren't. I'm going to stain and uh, a waterproof stain with those. Um, those are four that I've already made. The uh, the nearer two are uh, ones I made last year, and the uh, farther two are the ones I made uh, earlier this winter. And I'm going to add a couple more. I got some extra dirt back there. You can see in the background. So I'm going to add a. A couple more beds there. I'm not sure we can find something to throw in there. I also uh, made uh, some two by two beds that we're going to reserve for probably uh, uh, some of the uh, goji berry or nanking cherry or something like that. When I finally find a spot to uh, put them in, yeah. Right now they're. Uh, they're over along the the, uh, the fence line there and in pots. Uh, I couldn't uh, couldn't decide where I wanted to put them, so I'll just uh, hold off and I guess we'll use those little four by four beds when we finally do that. Hey, buddy, that's my security guard there, Max. And we're gonna get started finishing assembling these beds here. Um, what I'm doing is uh, since. Uh, the end pieces and the side pieces are four foot by eight foot to keep the dimensions the same instead of uh, kind of overlap the corners here. In this corner, you know, this, uh, the end piece will be on the outside. When you go down to the other corner here, the end piece is on the inside. So it won't change your dimensions when you make the bed. And we're gonna attach the other, the other corner here and we'll be done with this bed. So, stay tuned. All right, what we did here is we uh, drilled three little pilot holes into uh, the corner here to attach these uh, these two boards. And we're gonna have my uh, lovely assistant here put one of the uh, screws in. Go ahead and give it a shot, baby. Get it straight now. Straight, straight. There you go. Wait. Straight on. I don't want to do it. Wait. All right, there you go. Good job. Good Oopsies. job. All right. Now we're just going to uh, attach the rest. The other two here and there, and we'll also run some into the, uh, the support uh, wood that's behind it. And we'll be done with this corner. And there's a look at the whole thing assembled. Got that corner uh, fastened down. 
Uh, not going to stain them today. Well, we'll uh, do that probably next weekend or whatever. We're going to go ahead and uh, get this other one assembled here real quick and call it a day. And then there were two. We got the uh, other one done. Uh, took us about uh, 20 minutes to assemble it. And uh, it's just a little bit off square, but I don't really think the vegetables will care that much. But uh, there we go. Um, we'll stack them up here and we'll stain them uh, another day. Monday? Good job, Thunder. No, not Saturday. Monday. Saturday? Maybe.